at first glance you'll notice that there are a lot of new brushes here in the brush pop-up. Many of these new brushes give you hard surface and planar controls over your models. But before you jump in and start using each one of these brushes, it's a really good idea to understand where the settings and power for these brushes come from. The first palette that's important to notice is the brush palette, so I'll dock that over on the right. And the next palette is the stroke palette. I'll also dock that over on the right. Inside the brush palette, you'll notice that there's a new pull-down called Depth. We'll be discussing many of these settings later on. And inside the stroke palette, you notice that there are many new features added to the Lazy Mouse feature. And again, these features are what's controlling many of the brushes here inside our brush pop-up, which are creating hard surfaces, as well as many of these features can also control many of the brushes that you're familiar with here inside ZBrush. So we'll take a moment to talk about each one of these features and then move on to some of the different brushes in the pop-up. 